Hi folks, Bob Dale from Total Sales Solutions in Jackson, Mississippi. Well, we sell lots of things, folks. We sell a lot of motorhomes. For the last two or three years, we've sold hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of diesel trucks, four-wheel drive trucks. Well, lots of reasons for that. One, we like them. Two, our customers like them a lot because they are such values. And I'll tell you something else too, folks, which is funny. We're gonna list the Dodge truck today. It was so odd to me once we started selling these trucks. You can find 40 Fords, and you can find maybe five Chevrolets in comparison, and you can find one Dodge. Dodge trucks, Dodge diesel trucks are the hardest trucks to find on the secondary market that there is, especially one that you can sell for what you think is a reasonable amount of money, kind of a bargain, and that's what we're going to do today because we only sell on eBay. We're not open to the public. We don't have salespeople and all that. So we have to buy something that people are willing to come and get. Well, you'll be willing to come and get this one, I think, folks. It's a 2005 Dodge 2500 HD. It is a nice, nice truck, folks. A Laramie four-wheel drive. Now this Dodge, this Cummins diesel engine in this one is the high output. It's the HO. It's not the normal one. It, it, it is the big engine, the uh, Cummins HO. It has a leveling kit on it, uh, about a two inch uh, lift leveling kit on it. And we can say this, we always get corrected, but I can say this without question. It has a brand new set of tires on it. The reason we know, we just put them on. Come on, we'll show them to you. I mean, they may have 10 miles on them. They've they still got the coloring on them. You see the leveling kit installed? Glass is perfect, the windshield's perfect. Look under here, another opportunity to show you. Everyone will immediately call me and ask me about uh, rust. Obviously, no rust. You look inside here. Uh, windows, door locks, tilt, cruise. Seats are perfect. I can say it's only got 170, 80,000 miles on it, which is not even broke in for these trucks. A non-smoker's truck, the headliner's perfect. Uh, all the things that you'd want in a truck. Power CD changer, trailer brake. Power seat, see the seat working. The leather is perfect. Uh, look in here, Dan. Someone, this has been someone's daily driver. It's not been on a work site. It's not been a farm truck. It's not been abused in the mud. I want you to look at their window cleaning job. Uh, oh, we can't talk about that. See here, Dodge painted that. New tires, uh, there's your spare underneath it. Absolutely zero rust. Headliner, uh, bed liner's in it. It does have a uh, uh, ball already in it. Now you may or, not, may or may not need that ball, but if you ever do, it's there. And if you had to have it, it wasn't there. Trust me, those are expensive to put in. No dings and pings, not eat up. It was road dings. Pretty truck. I'll tell you what this truck does have, folks. It has a really big stance. Look in here. You can see, I mean, it's not been used in any way. It's not been handled. Is it right, drive good? Dan drove it over here. Cummins Turbo Diesel, Ram 2500. See how the lights are, how clean the right they are. The chrome is not peeling or any of that. This light. This is a pretty truck. Nice truck. My name's Bob Dale. My phone number is 601 218 1223. 601 218 1223. Call me anytime. Uh, mornings, evenings, weekends. If I don't answer my phone, I'll call you back. If you want to know, have any questions about this truck, call me. If you got a question about what it takes to buy it, give me a call. We'll sell it to you through eBay. That's the only way we sell, folks, is through eBay. Our trucks we generally sell before the sale's over. We pay all of our sales fees up front, so we're not, we're not cheating eBay. When we list one, that's what it costs, whether it sells or not. But you can go down to your local dealer. You can shop around, look over at eBay and see if you can find one this nice for the kind of money we're gonna sell this truck for. It's a real bargain, folks. It's a 2005 Dodge 2500 Cummins turbo diesel engine, the HO engine.
Cummins turbo diesel HO engine. It's a four wheel drive, has a little lift and leveling kit which gives it this big stance. Windshield's perfect, spares underneath it, bed liner. It only has 170 something thousand miles on it. Got a small kit. I mean, it's just a nice truck. It runs and drives to perfection and it's gonna be a bargain. So if you've been down in, to the Dodge dealer and you look at one of these trucks and it was 60 or $70,000, you'll find this appealing because that brand new truck, folks, that brand new truck, after about two weeks, will be just like this. They'll, all, they'll both smell the same, except you won't be making 800, 900, or $1,000 a month payments. It's a great truck. If you've been looking for your Dodge four-wheel drive, a 2005 Dodge four-wheel drive, 2,500, Turbo diesel HO engine, can't beat it folks, it's going to be a value. Thank you so much for watching our video, we appreciate that, and we look forward to seeing you here in Jackson, Mississippi. Before I take you on a test drive, Dad forgot to point it out, but we've got the original window sticker for this truck. You can see where it's stickered for 44885 it's got the uh, anti-spin differential electronic shift on the fly, 410 axle ratio, off-road group, security group, uh, class 4 hitch, got the light group, 17-inch um, alloy wheels, infinity stereo, sliding rear window, pretty much got everything you want. But uh, just thought it was pretty cool that we still have the original window sticker. Now I'm going to show you under the hood and we'll get on the road. Hi folks, Dan Dell here. You've been listening to my dad talk about this truck. Now I'm going to take you on a test drive, but before I do, just wanted to show you a couple things. This is the uh, 5.9 Cummins. We don't clean under hoods. This is just how it came into us. Main thing I want to show you though is absolutely no blow by. Now you can see not even any smoke, which smoke is no big deal, but when I set the oil fill cap down, it doesn't blow off, which means there's no blow by. If it blows off, then you got problems. You may hear a little light squeak not a big deal there's a new there's a pulley we've got to replace that okay now we're in the truck and ready to go let me turn the radio down you can see of course you got your uh, electric shift four-wheel drive you can also put it in neutral but all that works just like it should you got the cup holders got your ashtray that's clean CD six disc CD changer and uh, unlike most Dodges no cracks in the dash has the automatic dimming uh, rear view mirror uh, you can see it's got the overhead console there's your average miles per gallon distance to empty um, compass thermometer all that good stuff um, now you'll have to excuse my shaky camera work because I'm driving them with one hand and filming with the other on some of the worst roads in the city of Jackson so even though the video may come out a little shaky on the in the film, rest assured that in when you're in the truck, this this truck rides great. It doesn't bounce you around. It doesn't um, doesn't knock your feelings out or anything. And one thing you can also take away from it is that there's no squeaks or rattles. This truck is tight, so just something to keep in mind. Um, like we said, this truck belonged to um, the daughter of a friend of my dad's and she bought it not too long ago and was going to use it for uh, pulling horses and put a gooseneck in the bed and was going to start doing that, but she's had some uh, issues come up. And not going to have the horses anymore and so didn't need a, a four-wheel drive Dodge truck to pull it around with so these tires should just put the tires on these tires literally have about five miles on them if that um, the truck is just a, a nice truck inside and out it drives straight doesn't pull to the left or right doesn't pull to the left or right when you uh, hit the brakes Everything works. The air is ice cold. Um, this, these are all terrains, but they're a pretty aggressive set all terrains. They're big 285s, so they uh, are 
are nice and tall and with the leveling kit gives it the right stance and we've looked I've looked, checked around on this truck and tried everything I can think of to try on it I can't find anything that doesn't work like it should this is one of those trucks I would not hesitate to get in and drive anywhere so if you want to fly in drive it home you certainly can um, I don't know of anything wrong with it I wouldn't hesitate to load my family up and and take a trip in it and and we encourage everybody if at all possible you know fly in and drive it home you may not ever get down to this part of the country again so you know make a little vacation out of it Thanksgiving's coming up and all that so um, it's the right time of year to uh, to be considering that if you want to but also understand that you know not everybody has the time to do that so uh, we'll be glad to work with you and uh, on shipping whoever whatever shipper you decide to pick uh, we've got some companies we've dealt with before we can point you towards or you can get on new ship and you know don't be scared off by the initial quotes you get from these online tools for shipping because if you're not in a hurry you can get a lot better price on shipping than these online tools will tell you I mean as much as half what they tell you not you know not always but uh, it does happen so that's just something to keep in mind because odds are if you don't mind waiting anywhere from a couple days to a couple weeks then you can find somebody with an empty spot on their trailer that's headed your direction who will cut you a deal on shipping versus you know having to travel with an empty spot on the trailer so just something to keep in mind but like I said we encourage everybody just fly in and drive it home it's it's ready to make a trip I wouldn't hesitate to get in it and go anywhere and if I don't wreck it here with all these goobers um, but like I said it's a good running driving truck it's the high output Cummins turbo diesel 325 horse it's an 05 it's one of the last of what they call the good the good Cummins diesels although we sell the newer ones too and they're fine but lots of people prefer these 5.9s that don't have all the emissions junk on them and everything you can soup them up if you want to although this one's stock but you know you have that option so just something to keep in mind if you have any questions about this truck feel free to give me a call my number is 601-376-9869 or if you want to talk about it want to talk price whatever uh, want to make an offer you can call me or you can call dad um, you got his number too so we appreciate you watching our video and look forward to seeing you here in jackson mississippi thank you